from VUI Learning Institute, the Education Report, Alex Cool Land work as a volunteer on the Pacific Island Nation of Vanuatu, Natu, one of the best crop most remote play in the village village where she worked on the national but people has never worked that is not impossible some people have every learning resource but it's so we are falling behind Technic State University and her students developed a special type of library. It is called Solar Spell. It is an educational library that is powered by the sun. Dr. Hossman says she wanted to create a digital based library that would not be ruined in extreme weather. Although it does not use the internet, it creates a similar experience. Hosman says the library is an offline website that behaves like the internet. It permits students to practice using the internet on a smaller scale, Hosman says. Each solar spell unit comes with a memory card or a small plug-in device that holds the educational resources. It only uses a small amount of space and does not need power cables or electricity. Hossman and her students worked hard to find resources to put in the library. They chose materials that appeal to people who live in rural areas in the South Pacific, such as Vanuatu. The Peace Corps has used about 50 solar spell units. In Naviso, about 200 students have used it. For VOA Learning English, I'm Lucia Malonig.